Hello and welcome to Time Series Forecasting. In this chapter, I'm going to extend the concept of ARIMA models that we learned uh, in the previous chapter. And we are also going to extend the concept of regression models. I'm going to combine those two models to build uh, these models called dynamic regression models, also called uh, ARIMA X models. And we are going to extend uh, the three components of uh, ARIMA models by including uh, this uh, X uh, component uh, in the ARIMA model. In chapter 5, I talked about uh, regression models where we were trying to predict the Y variable uh, in terms of uh, these X variables. That is, we were trying to forecast this uh, variable Y based on some other variables and we call those variables X variables. That is, we were trying to use information in these x variables to predict or forecast this uh, y variable. So we were using these x variables as uh, predictors of uh, this y variable. The problem in the regression model that we discussed was that uh, those regression models do not allow time series uh, dynamics uh, to be included uh, in this uh, model. That is why we introduce uh, time series dynamics uh, using uh, ARIMA models. And in these ARIMA models, we talked about uh, three components, the AR component, the integration component, and uh, the moving average component. And we represented these three components by P, D, and Q respectively. And uh, we included uh, P lags of uh, the AR process in the model. And then we included forecast uh, errors in the model, which shows uh, this moving average uh, component. And hence we were able to capture time series dynamics uh, in these ARIMA models. But the problem was uh, that uh, ARIMA model in this uh, setup do not allow other predictors to be included in the model. That is, we were only including uh, the lagged value of uh, this Y variable in the model or we were using uh, the lagged values of uh, the error in the model, but we were not including uh, other relevant information contained in other predictors uh, in these ARIMA models. We are going to combine these two models together and uh, extend uh, both the regression model and ARIMA model so that we can capture not only the information contained in other predictors to forecast this Y variable, but also include uh, time series dynamics by capturing the information contained in the lagged values and the forecast error in the model. And hence, uh, we are going to use these uh, ARIMA models. And now these uh, ARIMA models will have uh, four components. The AR component, which will capture the time series uh, dynamics by using information contained in the lagged values of the Y variable. And then the integration part will make sure that uh, our time series is uh, stationary. And then we'll have uh, this MA component, which will capture uh, time series dynamics uh, in the forecast error. And now we'll include uh, this X component in the ARIMA model by using uh, other relevant information contained in these explanatory or extra predictors in the ARIMA models. So therefore, we will build our ARIMA X models or these dynamic regression models by combining uh, these uh, two models. In the next video, I'll talk about how to combine uh, both these models to build uh, these ARIMA X models. All right, I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.